Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. So, first things first, um, the new DLC for Battletech has dropped, obviously. Um, and I will probably be getting that this weekend. I'm just going to wait for Rogue Tech to update before our, uh, I install it and start doing anything with it. I, I kind of want to try it out uh, in the regular Battletech, but after playing for Rogue Tech for so long, for me, just going back to regular Battletech is kind of painful. Um, so I will wait for the update um, to a rogue tech. I know it's going to break save, so we're going to start a new series at that point. Uh, but that being said, um, let's just have a look at the star map. I haven't actually had a look at it yet since I logged in, so I have no idea what's going on. Yeah, it's still pretty much the same situation. So we are going to take a few missions here on this planet today. There's a couple of five scholars here. Um, so I want to just jump straight into the contracts here. So we've got a, um, a redirection mission here, 625 salvage, five skulls. It's basically uh, stealing one of the... Uh, um, Ghost Bear's uh, convoys and redirecting it. So it's just an escort mission. So we're going to take this one. I'm going to go full salvage because, you know, it is an escort mission. Hopefully we've got up to three lances. We can get some good stuff off this. So let's accept it. And we're going to run our main lance. Um, P, D, C. And we want to get Mockingbird. And we want to get uh, Six Pack and Rhino. And let's make sure this is the rack version. It is. And let's deploy and do this. All right, let's hope for some good resistance here today. Okay, this map. All right. Here we go. Hardcore, you know the score. Commander? Um, it is Ghost Bear. Let's try and stealth it a little bit. Don't know if it's really going to work out. Give it a shot, though. Uh, that is the... Uh, yes. I know you're blocking us now, but... Good to go. Is what it is. Long as we're behind the hill here. Waiting for orders. Okay, what do we got? Spirit Bear. That guy looks big. Alexander. Okay, been a while since I've seen one of those. Cougar and a Lupus. So 60, 30. Uh, 75, 70 tons, and probably, I think this is like 100, isn't it? Sure is. Streaks, Ultra 10, so he's got to be pretty close, so he's right now at a disadvantage. Destroy the Ghost Barian Patrol. Yeah, see, we can't uh, hide from these guys. What's up, boss? Double time. Um, yep, yep. On. A couple of solid hits. They've got a sensor lock on me. It's okay, I'm coming in to block you in a second here. Just give me a second. Wait, can we not? Oh, we can't see the guy from there. Can from here, though. Nope, trees. Be in the trees, please. Let's wind it up. I'm going to try and pull this guy down before he can go. And let's crank it right to the top. And hammer him. Kind of cool looking. Won't be in a minute, though. Oh, he's moved. Chicken! Lock on me. Doesn't leave much left to shoot, just the out of this guy. Wow. Thanks for showing up, buddy. Um don't have enough for vigilance on this, eh? Let's get to where that large improve can do some good damage here. That's the lupus. Good good chances on the lupus here. So let's take that. Um, yeah, not good enough for an offensive push. Let's just hammer him with everything. Standing 
goodbye. So, I want to pull, try and pull that guy out of the battle. We can probably pull him down faster. And if we can tag this guy, we can hit him hard. Okay, let's move back here. Rolling. Trees make superior ablet of armor. Uh... Yeah. Solid connection on that one. Mm hmm. Figured as much. Wow. That guy just chicken out or what? God damn right he's panicking. On my way. Gonna have to manage my AC twenty ammo. Warning. Armor low. You want to play the games? We can play the games. I'm good at playing games. Want to pull back away from that spirit bear. Um and let's go after the leg on this guy. Gonna have to leave off something significant here. Probably a large laser. See ya, leg. I was really hoping that lupus would have gone down earlier, but not much we can do that. Do about that now. Spirit Bear is hiding, man. I'm there. All weapons are go. There we go. That's a kill. What's up, boss? Um. Just conserve our ammo here. I'll be access, man. Uh, Commander? Roger. Full speed. Put an ultra twa ah, no. Nah. Not worth it. Not at that number. Not a bad damage spread for a, uh, like, 30-ton mech. Is he 30 or 35? Can't even really think it's 35. Two medium improved and LB-10X. Wow. It's actually a pretty good loadout. Not good enough, though. Gonna save that for later. Orders. On my way. Gonna 
gonna save this for later. Gonna take a turn and cool off here, I think. Waiting for orders. Should have sprinted, buddy. Should have sprinted. Gotcha. Hmm. Yeah, uh, yeah, sure. Gotcha. Ah, uh, not as good as she normally does, but still pretty good. Reporting critical hit. Standing by. All right, there's another hit. Got a better chance to hit from up here. Oh, that was terrible. Waiting for orders. Let's move. Oh god, that's such a hard choice. Let's just go this route. Oh. Not quite enough. Critical hit, Commander. Oh, we got a knockdown though. That'll do it though. Standing by. Okay, pull off the uh, left leg. Copy that, Commander. The whole left side, if you can. Bet that hurt. Yeah, he's like, fuck this idea. <laughs> He had enough. Don't blame you, buddy. Ready for orders. It's not worth fighting over. It's just a convoy. Yeah, somebody had the idea of being able to capture, uh, given the option of capturing those mech pilots as bondsmen. That'd be kind of a cool idea. But not how you would apply it to just the clan playing, though. So we're going to get Mockingbird to activate. Receiving you. Gonna come down here. Just run it. Direwolf's still pretty quick for its size. Receiving you. Going full throttle. Okay, let's get down to the fray. Waiting for orders. Um, I think we're ready. Well, you know what Thought did, though, right? Thought he farted, but he shit himself. Good to go. See what happens to us. See if we On it. just f fart or flirch. All right, let's do it. Convoy signal this right now. We transmit the new destination now. Keep them safe while they get there. You got it. Yeah, I had Mockingbird stay back because she's got the longest range weapons. Uh, let's just reserve her. Waiting for orders. Christ, really? On my way. There's two guys right here: Timberwolf and an Executioner. City and Skull, eh? At least they're going after these guys. The 
gonna go for a headshot on him. Gonna have to. Why do we have a marker over here? Mirix, of course. Well, it is the Five Skull mission, so... Executioner! Why are the chances so low to hit? Alright, well... 79. Okay, we got a head hit on him. Got lots of weapons. Let's see if we can finish him up. Oh, that was just a high shot. Damn it. Come on, let's get lucky. This be good. Nope. Commander? Targeting four alpha Okay, that's another head hit. There we go. Took a bit of time, but we got him. One left target. Running low on rack ammo, but I think this is the one that we really got to be paying attention to here. With this executioner and this uh, Mirix here, we got it. That's a 70. This is a hundred ton, I think, though, isn't it? Timberwolf, we should be able to more death. <laughs> I don't know if you caught that. Just written on the side of him. Right there. More death. Is that more death or no death? More death. At least that's what it looks like. Alright, uh... Standing by. They're gonna focus their attention on the convoy. Is that 100 or 85? He's got a lot of close range weapons. Mad Cat. Wow, that's a weird ass layout. He's got a bunch of lasers. So I'm thinking we take advantage of this guy. Taking advantage. Got some good initiative this turn. Hopefully it carries over into the next turn, but we'll see. I'm not sure who the hell you're shooting at. This 
got PPCs though. Up the yin yang. Makes me wish I brought a flamer unit. Um, no, gotta be able to target this guy. One mech at a time. Uh, that's perfect for an offensive push. Not the torso or. Let's go with the torso. I wanna get rid of this guy. Okay, cool. Now his left his yeah. Is that, yeah, his left side's completely open to the uh, Ultra 20. Executioner with weird ass arms. Okay, guys. Yeah, man, hit him with something. Shoot him. Do something. They're gonna kill you guys, so you better shoot at them. Mockingbird. Rolling. Wow. Do we just shoot or this? This is like. Yeah, a good chance to do a lot of damage there. Rack is jammed, that's fine. 114 left, eh? Well, I'm just gonna fire straight out. It's going down. Stay in the trees. Trees are superior, superior ablot of armor. Uh, let's pull out the large improved. CT, please. See ya. Enemy mech destroyed. Order? Le jeu de jugement. Time. Let's go. Judgment day. Make sure we got two shots coming up on his backside here. Yeah, baby. Enjoy it. Target neutralized. I like them apples. So we're finally getting some good weather up here in Ontario. It's a beautiful sunny day today. I was out cutting the grass earlier. He just kind of, this guy gave up. It's nice that we finally got some good weather up here. I mean, it's been pretty, I, I can't complain. It's been pretty good. Pretty good weather overall. Uh, yeah, let's go this route. I want to get rid of this guy fast. It's been pretty good weather overall up here, so I really shouldn't be complaining, but... It's like anything. You can always complain about the weather, you know? What do we got? We got 14 rounds left. Oh no, we got some shooting. Some shooting in this. I gotta get rid of these medium improved heavies. The low chances to hit and like the, the short range for the heat that they're adding. Gotta put something else in here. It's only two times. We gotta, we gotta figure something out. Yeah, don't bother with the rack. Save it for the next. Save it for the next group of guys. Ah, shit, he fell down. What do we got? We got 10 rounds left. That's five turns of firing. So let's turn the gosses off. Let's just see if we can take his head clean off. Eh. Looked like it was hitting the head area. Come on, let's finish him up before we before we get out in that circle there. Or in the hex, I mean. He's not having a good day at all. 
Don't turn around. Keep running. Keep. Oh, well, no, we can get behind you. Oh, he's getting a melee. No! Oh, my God. Look at this guy's arm. Got all Lee's oars. One of the reasons why I like having a large energy loadout like that is that I don't have to worry about, like, in long missions like this, if we're going to have enough ammo or whatever. Uh, we got enough for six more turns of firing, so we're just going to fire on this guy's back. See ya. Let's get that rack up. And let's get into a position where we know we can handle the next line of guys showing up. Although I don't really want to be in this valley. I wonder if we should keep Mockingbird up on the hill up there. Griff's got to get up this way. I want to get over in the flanking. Ah, right, here we go. Hold here for extraction. At least these guys kind of stuck together. Standing by. Um. Roger, Skipper. Kicking it. Let's close with these guys. What do we got? Night Gear, Wolverine, Exterminator, and Ryokin. So not so bad at all. Looks like their second lance was their heavy hitter lance. Let's see if we can move up towards this and start to engage them uh, closer to the hill. The night gear, depending on what it is, is going to be raining down some death. That was probably the gear, I think. That should put me in a position to get up the hill. Got two people there ready to go. Judge is woefully out of position, unfortunately. It's a tough choice whether I want that Ultra 20 up there or if I want the rack up there. I got to keep one person back to make sure these vehicles get out of here. It's the Jumpinator. Uh, yeah, Commander. Let's just get on the other side. This should give them still the ability to get out of here. It's double sprint to get to the top of the hill, but that's fine. Eh. Come on, guys. Yeah, we gotta wait one more turn. Waiting for order. Ready for order. Uh, let's just reserve you. Gonna reserve past the vehicles and then I'll move. That night, that the Wolverine was pretty slow last time. Exterminator. There's the Night Gear Prime. Ryokin. I didn't mind the Night Gear that we had, the, the uh, 4LRM20. It was a kind of an interesting loadout, but it just was limited by hard points. Exterminator! At five skull, it's kind of hard to, uh, unless you're like, you have a heavy mech and you can step on a vehicle, it's hard to wipe out a vehicle in one turn. Uh, you haven't gone yet, so, um, hello. Roger that. 
Sure is. Got his attention. So that's one less mech going to be shooting for the vehicles. Ryo can. I really love the thought behind designing the clan mechs. They just got this such a distinctive, cool look to them. Okay, let's see if we can finish up this guy. Or do we want to go after the Nike Air? Let's pull this guy out of the battle. Wow. Taking it like a champ. Taking it like a champ. Fifty, not bad. Still not gonna save your ass, but not bad. Let's let these vehicles get out of here. Fifteen and fourteen, and then they're out of here. Has a Nike here gone yet? I don't think he has. Here he comes. One. I, I don't know what you're shooting at. And two. Yeah. Let's deal some damage. Uh, we're going to shoot this guy though, because this side has not been damaged yet. I don't want to be wasting ammo on him, so let's just shoot at this guy. Um, let's warlord it up. Got a better chance to hit. Hopefully, not him. Even though it's a better chance to hit him, we still need to go after this guy. Oh yeah, two hits. Nice. Goddamn right it is. We don't mess around, man. Okay. Four against four. His arm is almost gone. I wonder what it would be to OP his head. I don't know. Let's find out. Ah, eh, no head hits. Oh, we did get a head hit. Almost. Ow. Stop shooting me, I just got a new damn paint job. On the move. See ya. He hung in there like a pro though, I'll give him that. He did hang in there like a pro. Wow, that's a lot of damage. And I'm going to stand in front of you in a second here. Alright, where is this guy damaged now? Mostly on the right side. That side. Right? Oh, it's so confusing sometimes! Okay. Screw you! I got you, buddy. I'll stand right in front of you. This guy's going to receive some pain. Shoot at my friend like that, will you? Mockingbird, they're shooting your lance mates. What do we do when they shoot our lance mates? We kill them, boss. We kill them. Not that I'm a chicken, but I let's not uh, lose a mech at this point. OK, 
Okay. Warning. Armor low. Orders? Full speed. No target. Got one one message for you, Ryken. Judgment time. Man, that Carl Urban Judge Dredd movie is the quintessential Judge Dredd movie. Carl Urban is Judge Dredd, as far as I'm concerned. What do you think, six pack? Time for a little bit of payback. On my way, double time. You got it, buddy. It's all yours. Aye, aye. There it is, folks. Mission successful. You know the one thing I hate about summertime now is that I constantly have to be looking for ticks on my body when I come back in from being outside. Look at this, five kills for six pack, man. I'm shocked a Mockingbird only got two. Six kills, man. And it's not like he's slower than everybody else and he just basically capitalizes on it. It's just that rack is so devastating. It's good. It's a really great explo exploitation weapon, too. All right. What do we want here? Cougar. Yeah, no. Hey, we can get a mirror. Mirax. Uh, do we want it though? 70 tons. Eh. Obsidian skull. How often are we going to see that? Oh, there we go. That's an easy choice. That's an easy choice. Another Timberwolf part. And we'll leave it there and then we'll just choose gear. I should take ER medium lasers because we don't have any. We severely need them. Hopefully we'll pick some up in the roll here. Uh, what else do we got here? P medium pulses. Like lots of stuff here. Uh, Ultra 10s. These are the Clanner version. We still got one left. Uh, e cooling plus one. Plus six E cooling. Really? Wow. Uh, I don't need any of this. Clan XLs. Enhanced imaging. We don't have any of these. We don't have an exchange. We need exchangers. Let's drop one in. Fire control system flak. Minus two recoil. Well, this would be pretty cool in the um, in the king crab. Let's drop that in. I mean, at this point, you know, really doesn't make that much difference. We're almost we're wrapping up the series, so but I want to get that Orion. Uh, Nova CWS. Ah, uh, yeah, probably that. Oh, crap, weapon mounts. Now what do we do? Timberwolf. We don't need that part. We need weapon, we need weapon mounts more. Uh, let's take the plus three mount. Yeah. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about that. Let's take this. Okay, executioner part. One, two. Two Mirix parts. Okay, we're at five now, so that actually puts it pretty close. Night Gear Prime. I think we have a different version of the Night Gear as parts, so that's okay. A couple, couple of it. Two Obsidian Skull parts. We got a extra Onyker part. Spirit Bear part. A couple of Wolverine C parts. You see, this was a really good run. Yeah, man, we got some pretty good stuff here. All right, there it is, folks. Ah, three hundred and eleven thousand. That's actually not that bad for the amount of damage we took on the one Timberwolf. Six pack got hammered pretty hard, that's for sure. But that's that was actually pretty good. A five skull mission with one hundred tonner and three seventy five tonners. I mean, we probably could have if with the right like if we had another Timberwolf, we probably could have pu pulled it off with four Timberwolves, most likely. Um. Yeah, it, I think that definitely could have been done with four Timberwolves. 
we probably would have taken a little bit more damage, but we would have had been a lot more precise with what we were targeting, like a lot of leg targets. But I think we, yeah, we could have done okay with that. Got 20 days left, so let's have a look uh, in the base here. Got the Kerensky Orion. Let's have a look here. Yeah, not a lot of hard points. And doesn't have much left. Wow. So 615,000. 632,000 to fix. Compared to our Orion 2C though, this thing really is just not going to cut it. Let's have a look at the Orion 2C really briefly here. I know we're still waiting for it to come back from repairs, but we got way more hard points on it. Let's have a look here. Yeah, like we've got way more hard points on this one, so as much as the Kerensky mech is nice and kind of cool and everything, um, gonna have to say goodbye to the Onaker, man. I mean, I could switch swap stuff out, but then it's just more time, more building. We've got mechs that are running fairly well right now, so let's let it go. Mockingbird didn't get hit? She never got hit. Cool. Okay, let's just, yeah. I know people are probably cringing at this, but we're at a point now where we don't need it, so. Yeah, see, yeah, it's a million. We could use the million, though. I know we got, like, almost 10 million now. I sold off so much stuff. You should have seen how many. I had, like, 50 clan double heat sinks. I sold off like 40 of them or something like that, and I don't know how many millions that was worth. It was ridiculous. Like if you go to the store really quick, they add up over time. Somebody mentioned that, you know, playing clans uh, just at the start is easy mode. And it's not really. When you're fighting the clans, it's not It's not really easy mode. Um, it's It can be easier, but it's not easy mode, especially if it's clan on clan fighting the whole time. Yeah, so these are like 120,000 each. So Sorry, so I, I sold 30 of them. So 30 times 120,000 is like, what, 3.6 million, something like that. So that's actually pretty, it's a pretty good pretty good way to make sea bills if, you, if you're just picking up clan double heat sinks, hang on to them and sell them off all in one shot. Anyway, so yeah, we got, our, we got some good sea bills here. Let's um, have a look at the contracts again. There's another five skull here. I can't remember what it was now. I think we should probably start taking some ghost bear missions because these guys hate us, but I don't know. Series is slowly coming to a, uh, so coming to a close anyway. Recovery mission. Um, sabotaging research stations, stretching our defenses thin. Key scientists, we're gonna okay, we're gonna go with the scientists and get them out. Yeah, we could do that. So let's go full salvage. Ghost bears hating us, but what can we do? What can we do? We're renegades now in the inner sphere. Oh, wait. We have to bring our second lance in. Going to be able to do with the second lance? I don't know. Let's find out. Uh, where are you? Hannibal the Cannibal? Let's get you in there. Uh, why is Rhino... I thought she would have been out. Oh, I brought Judge in. I, did, oh, I thought I had... Okay. Whatever. How did I... Whatever. I'm not even going to bother. Uh, av <laughs> Avalanche, let's bring you in here. Gaucho, let's get you in. All right, so we've got the King Crab. The Zeus has got... That's the double launcher, right? Yeah, the double launcher. So let's give that to Gaucho, right? We were going to give... See, this is a thing that's going to get tricky now because... Uh, it is five skull. Do we want to go with the ATM power or do we want to go with PPC power? These are 380 damages. And this is a shit 27 missiles times 14 or something. So three times 80 is 240. If these all hit though at HE at 14 damage a pop, 27 times 14. Uh, 270, 
three something. But it is a lighter mech, so it could take a lot of damage. But you know what? Let's just try it. This is the I think this this is what we had last time anyway, so let's go this route. Okay, let's get in and out of here. Jeez, that's far away away. Alright. Should have. Should have brought them sunglasses. Need to get you up front. Yes, Commander. Full speed, no target. Battle Master's gonna run hot down here. So I gotta be careful with that. Okay, let's get up to our corner here. Yeah. I guess we should send her in to see if we can find out if we're facing turrets as well. Time. Waiting for orders. I copy. God, it's nice to have speed on the Black Knight and stuff. Yes, Commander. Copy that. What do you need? I need you to hit me up with some sensor traces. Okay. My sensors found something. Legacy? KDK Kodiak Marauder 2C. Oh well, this will be interesting. He's got ultra fives, large pulses. Pair of racks. Wait, are we shooting over our, yeah, it's too close to our own guy. I'm sure the artillery shot would have been fine, but. What can I do for you? I need you to get the hell up here so we can take on these guys. Thank you. Commander. On my way. Double time. Yep. Let's wait for people to get into position, please. Arctic Wolf 2. Yes, Commander. Copy that. What's up, buddy? Yeah, man. Suck it. That hit something good. Lost evasive. Yep, Kodiak. Somebody went all out. Reporting internal damage. Yep. Waiting on you, Commander. No, we're waiting on you for Christ's sake. Screw this guy.
shot got past my armor. Yeah. I can see that. Dude, I'm standing in a mineral field. Do they think they can hurt me? I know, that's what I was just thinking. Ready it's like, what the me? hell? Roger. Shit, that's the wrong side. God damn, my fucking directionally dyslexic mind. It's like, hey, here, blow me up. He should be going down, though. I love the little bear head on him. Somebody else back there. Atlas. Oh, man. Say hello to my little friends. Get in here and some fuck some shit up, man. Bang, you're dead. Manda. Moving to position. Enjoy the fire, buddy. Ping. Eh. No, I didn't. Look at the fire. Look at the fire! Come on, man. Throw down. You know, I, I I slammed that Arctic Cheetah or the Arctic Wolf at the beginning there, but it's putting out some big numbers. Such a little guy here. I have to spend another turn finishing him up here. You betcha. Time to duel it out. Yeesh. Medium pulses are just backups anyway. When I shoot you, you'll take it and like it. Oh, you'll take it, but he ain't gonna like it. He's lost initiative too. He's gonna get a face full of ATMs in a second. You'll do what I tell you. Acknowledge. Should be going down. No? Orders. I'm going to add chaff to B, and everything else is going to A. So that's some inferno on this guy back here.
Oh, we got a knockdown on him too. Nice. Now maybe Rhino can uh, dust out this Arctic, Arctic jerk. That's correct, right? That's the, yeah, that's the right side. That's the right, oh my god. See ya. Oh, he's taking it like a champ. That hit something good. Look at the fire. He's just in an inferno. And it's not like he can move out of it anytime soon. Uh, okay, I stand corrected. Yeah. Push him. Got it. Push him. Don't let him get away. Confirmed. Yeah, baby. Have a seat. Badass. Yeah. Love the flames painted on too. It's pretty cool looking. Goes with all, goes with the fact that he's on fire. <laughs> Arctic Wolf's probably going next. Yep. Sure. Whatever you want to do, bud. You keep firing away back there. Yes, Commander. See ya. Wrecked him. Half file removed. I hear ya. Somebody got a little butt hurt there. Let's clear this guy out of here. Uh, can you lay a, little, lay a little minefield over there for me, please? Um, let's go with Narc on this guy. Actually, let's go with Chaff on him. Confirm the Warlord. Have a seat. What do you need? Um, his ass is on the ground. Let's take advantage of that. Um, Huh. We need more damage on that leg. Roger. Uh sure. Sure. So th that's right. Okay. <laughs> Gotta keep thinking about it. Uh, how much you got left here? Not a lot. Alright, there's the right leg. Think I, hit something good. I think you did too. Alright, handle the cannibal. See if you can take that leg off.
Pretty good chance to hit. Nope. Damn it. Hopefully it'll come off when he moves. Um. Yeah. You finish that guy up for me. Nine left, huh? Attacking from position. There we go. All right, let's get close to our extraction point because maybe we make a beeline and get out of here, depending on what the resistance is. Black Knight's taking some significant damage. Oh, there it is. Nice. All right, well... Not too bad. Yeah, see, we took a bunch of internal here. I wasn't going to risk it. if I, I was going to make a break for it if we had to. But not so bad. Um, we can't really complete anything. Atlas 2Cs, Ultra 5s. Got like four of them already. Cooling pods, e-cooling plus two... Let's take this for the sea bills. Um, wow, not a lot down here. Ooh, rack five double ammos. Uh, should we take three of them? That's gonna give us some extra. Let's just do that. Oh, there's the rack fives up there. Now we wanna do this instead. Let's ditch DXL. Oops, I should've left that extra rack five double. Let's take the clan rack fives. And an extra ton of ammo. Yeah, that, that's actually really good here. That's a good payout. All right, we got two Atlas II C parts, Kodiak Legacy, Arctic Wolf II Prime, 40 tonner, large pulses, medium heavy laser, streaks, cooling pods, more heat sinks. Yeah. That mech you wanted is back online. Uh, okay. We just picked up an atlas. What, what? Oh, well, the mechs are rolling in now. The mechs are rolling in now. I can't, I always got an atlas. I can't believe that. What the hell? Not a lot of hard points, though. But it's still an atlas. Let's have a look here. Doesn't look like there's much left on it, though. I don't know why they're so angry about a skinny dipping in the cooling tank. I mean, where else are we supposed to skinny dip? That's what I, I mean. We got the zero-g pool, but that only it's fun for only so amount, for a certain amount of time, right? Uh, okay, so we got four laser points in the arms, a ballistic and a missile on the torsos. Two more missile or laser points in the CT, which we rarely ever get to use any spot spaces in the CT. I know it's an atlas, but honestly, <laughs> that's a lot of money to fix this thing. Let's just leave it for now. Um, it's got lots of armor, I guess. We could just make it a tank, I guess. But I'm still, I'm still a big fan of the speedier builds, you know. Um, I just am. 
speedy builds with hard, punchy weapons? Like, I don't know. <laughs> I'm like half an inch away from scrapping it. Half an inch away from scrapping it. But it's an atlas, so we're going to let it sit in the bay for now. We still got five months worth of uh, payouts here. Or, uh, Steve Bills, so we're okay. I mean, I don't know. We're going to jump systems anyway. So between now and the next episode, I'll decide what we're going to do with it. Uh, it is an Atlas, so I mean, I guess we should keep it, but I don't know. It, we're doing okay with the missions we've got uh, with the five scholars, so I think we may not need it. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I'm just going to leave it there for now. All right, so that's going to be the end of the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you, did, if you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can drop any comments in the comments section down below. Um, Atlas, yes, no? And if, if yes, what do we load it out with? I don't know. Um, I'm going to have to do a check on the racks that we have currently. Um, I think the rack in 6-packs pa mech is an inner sphere version, in which case we'll get a few extra tons out of that machine for sure. Going to have to look at the medium improved heavy lasers in Rhino's uh, Mad Cat um, that uh, augment the um, the uh, Ultra 20. And then yeah. That Orion 2C, I mean we could double rack it up again and run the same mech that we had at the beginning of the game. But I feel like we've already gone that route, so I don't know. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I don't know. We'll figure it out. All right, so I'm going to leave the episode there. Uh, until next time, we'll see you all later.